Hi right, guys, back again, been a while since I've been online, or YouTube, sorry. Um, look, I've got some goodies in the mail coming, spend a bit of money. Um, got some goodies for Christmas, which I'll show you in another video once me two parcels arrive. I'll show you what i got, um, and what I'm going to do. I am still going to do a wheat beer eventually, but I've got a couple of power owls to do. And another lager, which I'm going to do later on, do a clone lager. But I've got two power, hour, power hours I'm going to do. But once I get all my new um, ingredients and other equipment, I'll show you what i got. Um, but um, I've just got some beers in the fridge I've had about 16 months and less. So I'm going to only just put them in the fridge today. So I'm going to give them a good week to just cold condition, whatever, just settle and... Usually in the fridge for about a week for us to crack them open up. I know it's right. So just in the plastic pet bottles I had for about 16 months or a bit longer. Uh, just a dark ale. So I'm doing reviews on this. It's a Cooper's one. Just stick sand kick kilo, but uh, it's actually pretty nice. What it is this one. I actually like this one, but I'm gonna do something else with it later on. Like do another one, but not sand and kick kilo. I'll still do get your kit, but. I might just yeah, put some grains and some hops or something in it. In the next one, I have an IPA that's oh, about 13 months old. So I don't know, it's not going to be like after that long. Probably bitter, because the last couple I had, oh, that's four or five months ago. They were pretty bitter not to tip them all out. So, yeah, I don't know. If, I'll see how this one goes. If it's bitter, I'm not going to bother. Yeah, and I got a homemade apple cider I made from scratch about eight, nine, ten months ago. Yeah, the sediment on the bottom is pretty thick because the apple matter. So this one, yeah, I'd be worried it wasn't carbonated probably, but now this bottle's really hard after so long. Fingers crossed. Time about a week's time to do a review on this. It's good. If it's good, I'll upload a video. If not. Yeah, but uh, I've got a whole box out in my man cave of that to drink eventually. Um, yeah, I've just uploaded a video just before. It's got, I've got one more silent video just done. Couldn't bother talking. Um, I've lost one video of um, on my craft bees, a, a dark ale I did. So I have to go down to bottle shop and. Um, Go buy, go find it, buy another one, do a review on that because that was really nice. Um, but I hope you guys had a good holidays or are on holidays, whatever. Good Christmas, good New Year. Enjoy yourselves, be safe. Um, yeah, I just got back from camping uh, a few days ago and back to work for a couple of days. Um, I had a good time off camping down the beach. Um, yeah, it was a good time away from work. Yes, I've had a haircut, so they shaved my beard a bit. Um, but yeah, during the week, once my parcels arrive, I'll show you what goodies I've got. Then once I get these beers on, I'll show you how it's going. I'll do a dry hop stage, so just to show you guys how it's all going. But yeah, I'll better cut it off here and. Um, yeah, because it's gone long enough, this video. I'll just, yeah, just a quick update, really. And there'll be another video during the week, just uh, updating goodies. Well, mainly goodies I'm going to show you, so. Um, what I've got in the mail. I've got two bo boxes coming, 41, 42 kilos worth of stuff, so. That's equipment, grains, hops, other bits and pieces. Because I did get some stuff for Christmas, for brewing wise, as well. For, had a bit of money spare, so I thought why not get on a home brewing website and just purchase a lot of stuff I don't need to purchase for all now. I need a new stuff. But anyway, guys, have a good one, and I'll see you. As, well, upload another video during the week once my goodies come. I'll show you what I got. Too easy.